Today on the Brick Sensei, I present something weird, something odd, something completely crazy and coincidental. But no, it is not the Brick Sensei with the Green Lantern power battery. Hey, that is extremely odd. I agree, Green Lantern. It is definitely not the Brick Sensei meeting Batman. Hey guys, I'm here. Don't worry. And, uh, meeting Batman, that's pretty awesome for anyone. It is. Creating an extremely abstract vehicle with Lego pieces you found on the floor. So yes, this is a custom brick creation made with pieces found on the floor at my feet. Took like two minutes to build this thing, just found a place for all these pieces, not very big, and it's kind of pointless. I guess it has a few uses, it could be like a face, these are like the eyes, a little forehead, something like that, pinchers, whatever you call those things, or it could be some kind of drag vehicle or upside down vehicle. You could even make it, if I could get it to balance, a little bit of a car kind of thing. And you could have Brick Sensei go on it right here. And it'd be like the Brick Sensei in a vehicle. You wouldn't be able to sit down though. You could probably bend him over. But then you'd lose his hat just like that. So I also thought in the position that I found that it actually works. This is one of the main positions. It could be some kind of couch, such as this, like that, and oh. It'd take a little bit of more designing, but you get the picture. So some kind of couch. Overall, oh, it can also stand up like this, so some kind of, I don't know, weapon or something. You could have them sit or stand or whatnot, and you know, it just looks like an abstract piece of work that was created in two minutes. So if this isn't the randomest video you've seen on the Brick Sensei, then I would be surprised because this is one weird creation. Once again, it was made with pieces I found on the floor. Brick Sensei out. So what do you guys think? What should we do? Uh, touch it! That is a good idea, Batman, but we should probably be pretty careful. Green Lantern, can you barricade us? Uh, uh yeah, yeah, Brick Sensei, I, 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 think, I think I can. Okay, you totally can, bro. You got this. Now you have to be very careful, and I want you to gently prod it with one of your energy beams from your ring. Yeah, yeah, my ring, my ring, got it. Okay, so... Let's go barricade ourselves. Okay, come on guys. We'll figure this out. Hey, what took you guys so long? Sorry, we we are. Well, well, you you just grapple hooked away. Yeah, I I have a tendency to do that. Anyway, let's start. Okay, just wait for Green Lantern. Okay, slow poke. Okay, Hal, do your thing. Uh, what what was my thing again? Uh, you're gonna gently prod the mysterious piece and see what happens, right, Batman? Uh, Batman? What? Nothing. Just curious as to why you have to put on a metal suit. It's always good to be prepared 
for anything. <laughs> okay, Lantern. Do your thing. I got your back. Hey, nothing happened. Batman's right, nothing happened. He, 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 yeah, guys, nothing happened. That 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 shook me up. I am totally never doing that again. I don't trust this brick. Oh, lighten up, Green Lantern. Do you guys feel anything? And that's why I always wear my armor. <laughs>